this afternoon and this morning presenting great music for your listening pleasure. And in the studio we had some wonderful, wonderful guests. Firstly, I'm going to go local. I'm going to go with two guys from the group Harmony. May I say good afternoon, gentlemen, and welcome, welcome to the studio. Good afternoon. Boy, that was in Harmony. And a cappello <laughs> as well. How can you beat that? Wow, that's terrific. How are you two guys doing? What? Everything is the same, but I'm trying to see. All right. <laughs> well, tell me, give me the guys' names. Uh, my name is Gavin. And I'm Chris. Oh, fine. Now, you are two of the group, right? How many are there in the group, actually? There are uh, actually five of us. Five of you in the group. Five of us. And, and you're all, everything you do is a cappella, I understand. Yeah. Yes. Which is very, 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 very beautiful. I mean, there's been some great a cappella groups, and hey, we're going to have a. Bahamian grown a cappella group, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. That sounds terrific. And how long have you guys been actually doing it? Singing and getting together? We have been doing this for about a year yeah. and a half. Right. Yeah. A year yes, and a half. We, we started inside high school. Uh huh. Which high school? Jackie Jackie Wood. Wood. Hey! Oh the men, the men, the men, right? right. That's yeah. terrific. And you started it, what, you just got together and you stood around like and got together. Putting yeah. songs together or what? How did it start? Well, actually, one of the group members, Tyrone, he had started a previous group called the Browns. Uh huh. And they didn't last for too long, so he started to find other members outside of his family. First, there was Chris and William, my little brother, who is actually one of the members of the Harmony. And after Chris and William, he incorporated his little brother, Ty um, Logan. Logan, Logan, Brown. Logan. After Logan, it was me. So we just got together, put a couple of songs down, and ever since then we have been, yep. we've been Practicing all over the place singing. In the restaurants, you know. And now let me ask you: Did you do? Are you churchgoers? Did you do any singing in church in the choir? Or of anything? course. Yes, yes, I we mean, do. That's, oh, that's that's your that's stuff. Definitely. Then, you know, yeah. we've got to find out where it actually really started to come from. Right. And then you banded together and put the voices together and you blended. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You, see, you could, like, like they used to have many, many years ago, they used to have a thing called doo-wop, where the guys used to stand on the street corner and oh, all yeah. sing together and harmonize. Yeah. You're, you're doing a Bahamian version of it, man. Yes, yes, sir. That's yes, phenomenal. Are. That's great. That's great. Hey, yes, I've got a thing to do. Give me a little bit. All right? Put something together. <laughs> yeah, yeah, go ahead. Falling in love with Jesus, falling in love with Jesus, falling in love with Jesus was the best thing I've ever, ever done. Falling in love with Jesus. Jesus, falling in love with Jesus is the best thing I've ever, ever done. Well, that's beautiful. That really is nice. Considering there's only just two of you there, I can imagine with the other three guys, that would be a phenomenal sound. Right. Now, do you only do religious music, or do you... You do, do you write anything for yourselves? How do you go about that? Well, currently now, we are in a studio. In a studio right now. And we are doing some of our own original songs. We are actually writing our songs right now, so. Now let me say, well let me ask you, which studio are you in with? Um, we're with... <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, we're with um, Kevin Fox. Ah, Kevin Fox in right, the yes. That's where we're at right now. Well, that's true. Currently. Because you realize that in the studio, occupying the end of the table, is a very, very, very important gentleman by the name of Mr. Kermit Henderson. Right. He's a superstar maker. Yeah. You know, he wanted to start with me, but I said, no, no, no. I'm <laughs> so, Kermit, I want to welcome you to the studios at Core 96. Thank you very much for having me here. It's a pleasure to have you here. I know that you're going to bring us in and tell us some wonderful things about some of the folks that you've actually put onto the market and, and made stars and everything. 
How are you thinking about these guys? Have you approached them at all? Uh, yeah, actually, I'm, I'm, I'm already a, a big fan of theirs. They sang happy birthday to me uh, Saturday. was my birthday. Well, and they sang happy birthday to me in the restaurant. Really? That's yeah. terrific. Which yeah. restaurant were you at? Are you allowed to say that? The reason I'm saying, Agave. if you live in the Wendy's, I'm behind the counter. What was the name of it? Agave. 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 Oh, very yeah. nice indeed. Yes. Noel and his wife there. Beautiful restaurant. Right. So you had a happy birthday greeting. Right? Yes, sir. That's terrific. And welcome, welcome to the Bahamas. Are you new to the Bahamas? Yes, thank you for having me. I, I came here several years ago, but this is a, it's a different look now, so I might as well, this might as well be my first time. <laughs> and where are you actually based? Where is your where is your I'm actually out of Cleveland, Ohio. I see. Mm -hmm. wow. So you're going to come down and take these guys maybe back to Cleveland and record them? Or oh, yeah, we might do something with them. They're very talented. I'm very excited about them and I'm excited for them. Well, that's terrific. I mean, they, just the two of them, they sounded tremendous, really. Uh -huh. You know, they've got, there's been some wonderful a cappella groups out. And I was going back, I was talking to the guys that were over here. Do you remember when they were over here? the guys that came and did the show Natural D7. Right. Okay. Yeah. But I was going way, 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 way back to a group that was a group called the Swingle Singers mm. that were in, in Europe. But they did classical music, a cappello, to a jazz background of a bass player and a drummer. Cool. And then you've wow. got so many, many, but to you guys, tremendous. I mean, all I can do is wish you every success because just two of you sounded tremendous. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, thanks, thanks a lot. So tell me something, COVID. Tell me something about... What the folks that you can bring up. Well, I'm working with a phenomenal young lady right now by the name of Chris Stell, and I believe you have her CD and in, yes. in there. And uh, she is from Gabon, West Africa. Ah. Uh, she's now based in Las Vegas, Nevada, and uh, she's new to the U.S. She's only been about three years, and in that short period of time, she's learned to sing, she's learned to dance and perform. And because when she first came to the U.S., she didn't even speak English, but her CD is in English. Uh, her New single, VIP, which you have there, and you also have her next single, My Hair. Uh, when we release her, uh, when we release them as a single, uh, they're all going to have French versions and Spanish versions on them because, you know, uh, French was a, French was a, the native language for her in, in Gabon, you know, other than their local language. Beautiful. You know? Well, then also, French is not the, the national language, but, I mean, that can go into the Haitian market, mm -hmm. into the Dominican market, into all the market where they have French-speaking right, exactly. groups. I mean, that, that has got worldwide yeah. significance there. Right. How about us playing a track, right? Yeah, sounds great okay. to me. The track we're going to play is VIP, okay. which couldn't be nice. So let's go in here. And this is Christelle. <laughs> All right, you can hear? 